Then I went to this place this morning, uh, what's it called, Dust Bros? You guys been there, right? Yeah, the high school musical of coffee. Why the fuck are those nerds so happy, bro? I'm a happy dude, I'm a happy guy. I'm, I'm not like, I was just waiting for Zac Efron to cha-cha out there like, do you want a coffee? I'm like, give me my fucking coffee. But something ain't right there. That's some Scientology shit right there. Like, Chick-fil-A used to fuck with me when I go there, but I was like, no, 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 I'm on to you guys now, bro. I'm gonna rearrange Dutch Bros every way I can, make sure it doesn't spell out like Satan's devil juice or some shit. Weirdest fucking place ever. I don't know how that's a... Am I gonna go there tomorrow? Yes, absolutely, bro. I like it because they have a cold brew there. You guys drink the cold brew coffee? You guys know what this is? Yeah, if you guys don't know what the cold brew coffee is, uh, it's just a type of coffee you drink when you are tired of cocaine. This stuff is <laughs> goddamn beautiful. How is the FDA not shut this shit down here? Like, here's how crazy this shit is. It's the only time I've ever had somebody who wasn't a doctor, a drug dealer, or my mom tell me how much of a dosage I should have, right? <laughs> the guy at Dutch Bros is like, all right, fucking dude. And he grabs a cup. <laughs> you guys think I'm kidding, bro? Go in there, he's got one piercing right there and a green mohawk. His name was Blake, right? So he, I swear to God, dude. So he hands me, he goes, dude, okay, so he, <laughs> he goes, I swear to this is what he said. He's like, yo, I don't know what you got going on today, but I'd start with the quarter, see how you feel in about 15 minutes. <laughs> like, yo, is, like, what, is there weed in this thing, Blake? Like, what, is this Dutch bros or dank bros? What is going on right now? I didn't like the fact that this little kid didn't think I could handle it. I was like, listen here, theater major, okay, bro? I think I can handle your coffee. I got so offended to the point where I actually started listing a resume. Like, you ever do that when somebody presses you of just cool shit that I've done? I was like, listen here, Blake, I don't know if you know this, but last year I went to Coachella and bought cocaine, molly, and ecstasy off a white dude with dreadlocks and a Miley Cyrus t-shirt, okay? <laughs> I drank the full thing right in front of him. Later that day, I had so much energy, I robbed my own apartment. You guys ever, <laughs> you guys ever done that one? <laughs>